So first I'm going to show you using this thicker lines and uh, different colors so it's easier for you to see and then later on I'll show you with the actual braided lines. So you put both lines across one another pointing to different direction and then you start from one end make a loop and wrap the tight end over and around both lines through the loop so in this case I'm going to make four wraps once you've done that you pull it tight but not very tight and then you go to the other end so same thing actually make a loop over both lines and then go through the loop and wrap around both lines so four wraps here again and then you pull it tight once you've done that you pull both lines tight so both knots will meet so this is the knot you will get so pull it tight and then pull the tight end make sure everything is tight use a plier or hemostat if you need to once you've done that you can cut the tight ends off so this knot is strong I use it all the time and uh, it's not failed me so that's how your knot should look like so now I'm going to show you the same knot using braided lines so put both lines over the other and then you start from one end make a loop now if you have more line this will be easier so wrap around both lines go through the loop one two three four five and you pull it tight and then you do the same knot on the other side so again make a loop now this this knot is best for lines that are the same or about the same diameter if the lines are the diameters are too great the difference you can still use it But when the diameter difference are too great I will usually the thicker line will have less wraps and then the thinner side will have a bit more wraps so once you pull both knots tight pull both main lines to get them together So both the knots are actually jammed onto each other so pull tight and then pull the tight ends tight and the other side
pull them tight again. And then now you can cut the tight ends off. So this is how the knot looks like. This is called the double uni knot, by the way. So if you just tie one side, it's called a uni knot. So one of the most useful fishing knot you can learn. <laughs> 